heard through an open door. The music of a silver band drifts down Queen Street. It has a regal feel, processing down this narrow seaside road of cottages, demanding its rightful due. Listen, I come with trumpets, cornets too. People glance from windows, but there's nothing much to witness today other than the blue and sudden view of the sea. Soon glimpsed through gaps between the houses, there are no cars, no cavalcade, just a tune. Lovers on benches hold hands and smile. Walkers stride past, sticky in the heat, pretending not to notice, immune. But the music of a silver band presses on, out through great thickets of red valerian and the common flag-waving pink. A wild yellow rabble of rapeseed joins the ranks. No gaudy deck chairs here, but an audience is gathering along the crumbling tarmac border and the upthrust shore. Stand back, boys, the music's here. They must be practising hard tonight, packed tight there in the band room. Tubers, horns, trombones are dripping, sweating, fighting for space and air, some fretting to be off the leash for it's hot, but no stopping. Deep and guilty as a slab of chocolate, a stirring anthem of familiar sentiment melts into final chords both sweet and sad. Out on the shriveled sea wind, my nomad feet crunch awkwardly behind the beat. The music of a silver band calls out to all beyond the rocky platforms of this town. The wary heron, perching at the sea's edge, may hear it and deign to raise his head. Those twisted fossil fish, long trapped in layers, may hear and tremble at the passing of the years. But the light is going now, and the heat of the day. The baton is put down, the music fades away into the tide, which laps this flattened fringe of land, leaving behind a memory of summer and a thirsty band. <laughs>